Gerald Community After School program has been around for over 30 years. Even when the school was named after, it was no longer open, which says something about the program itself. Once you become Let's see, Allison's 18 in college and came here when she was in second grade. So, I want to say quite a few years now. <laughs> and Kim Lewis also says that the variety of the classes are what keep people coming back, aside from the staff itself. The tight knit community. The, um, you know, the givings that they have for all the kids, no matter what their interests are um, or what they're into, it, it's definitely something that provides for activity. Dodgeball and tennis. Well, not tennis, but dodgeball, yes. Let you do stuff that you want to do, like soccer, movies, and pizza every single day. The program is run by Carolyn Rodriguez, who, aside from running the program, coaches a baseball team. But even with the schedule that comes along with the she tends she makes time for every student, no matter who it is. Carolyn Rodriguez. Well, let me tell you, she is uh, my friend as well. Um, but, you know, aside from being my friend, I've gotten to know her over the years through, um, you know, through the program. Um, she took over the program from Pat Daly quite a few years ago, and it's it's been refreshed, and it's new, and it's alive, and there are multiple kids here of all race, and she's got a special heart and love for every one of them, so she means a lot to me. She is a really fun person. She is my baseball coach. She really has fun after schools like dodgeball. Fitzgerald After School Program is one that has helped the children of the Cambridge community for many years. And because of the support it garners from families, it will continue to be a part of the community for many more years. For Emerson's Digital Journalism, I'm Sammy Washburn.